Our top story on WCNC Charlotte tonight. Hundreds, if not thousands more Wells Fargo employees will be headed back to their uptown offices. The announcement made today is a big step after two years of many employees working from home. And it also means uptown businesses that lost many of their customers could finally get back to normal. WCNC Charlotte's Hunter Signs has the details. On March 14th, more Wells Fargo employees will head back to these uptown offices to work a hybrid model. It's a milestone in this pandemic, especially for those who work right underneath them. Uptown will soon sound and feel a bit more normal. We're ready to go. Thursday, Wells Fargo announced employees and customer facing roles and other staff will start a hybrid working model part time back in these offices and part time at home. I have started to see some more people uh, coming back downtown. Below two Wells Fargo Center, the owner of Johnny Burrito can hardly wait. Come here, rookie. For more customers. All the restaurants have been hurting. I tell you, probably half of them have closed. When we visited him last August, he was hurting, only getting about half the business he was used to. This has been the toughest time I've ever had in 23 years. I can tell you that. Omicron meant less business in January, but he's now focused on March, when more familiar faces may just come back for a visit. If downtown can just at least get back to 50% capacity Monday through Friday, I think we'll all be doing a lot better. In Uptown Comeback, bitter can nearly taste. We're ready to serve you and we're happy to have you back. Those new and old customers will have to follow a few COVID guidelines, though. Wells Fargo says any unvaccinated workers will have to wear a mask at all times while they're here in the buildings. They will also have to follow testing requirements, but some good news. Wells Fargo says that their workers can start traveling again and seeing clients. In Uptown, Hunter Signs, WCNC Charlotte.